Apple is about to do something unusual, something that rarely happens in the tech world. No keynote, no elaborate stage production, no long-winded presentation. Just a quiet, efficient product refresh that lands silently in Apple's online store, but carries massive implications for your living room, smart home, and streaming setup. Mark your calendars. November 12th. Apple plans a stealth launch, likely accompanied by a simple press release and updated product pages. Blink, and you'll miss it. But if you care about gaming, 4K streaming, smart home control, or future-proofing your living room, you need to pay attention. In this video, we'll break down every single detail about the upcoming Apple TV 4K refresh and the new HomePod Mini. We'll cover the rumors, leaks, insider confirmations, and speculated performance upgrades. By the end, you'll understand why Apple's quietly refreshing these products could transform how you experience your home entertainment and smart devices. Apple TV 4K, why this upgrade matters. The Apple TV 4K might look almost identical to its predecessors from the outside, sleek, minimalistic black, but the inside tells a completely different story. According to multiple leaks, including insider reports from Mark German and other reliable sources, the new Apple TV 4K is set to receive a major internal overhaul. A new brain, A7 Pro chip. The headline feature is the rumored A7 Pro chip, a step up from the A17 Pro class processors in current Apple devices. This chip brings console-level performance to Apple TV, capable of handling more complex games, smoother graphics, and more intensive applications than ever before. Think of it like having a mini gaming console tucked under your TV. The A7 Pro chip supports hardware-accelerated ray tracing, a technology usually reserved for high-end gaming PCs and next-gen consoles. In practical terms, this means games and apps will feature sharper lighting, realistic shadows, and smoother reflections. Apple is essentially turning Apple TV into a serious contender in the living room gaming space. Memory upgrades, goodbye stutter. Rumors suggest the new Apple TV 4K will feature 8 gigabytes of RAM, doubling the current capacity in older models. Why does this matter? More RAM allows bigger, richer games and apps to load assets without stuttering or slowdowns. Streaming apps will launch faster, games will feel smoother, and multitasking within Apple TV will feel instant. For developers, this opens up opportunities to bring console-quality experiences to Apple Arcade or third-party gaming on Apple TV. Next-gen wireless with N1 chip. One of the less talked about but incredibly impactful upgrades is Apple's rumored N1 wireless chip. This is Apple's custom-designed Wi-Fi and Bluetooth solution, optimized specifically for Apple devices. Potential benefits. Wi-Fi 6E or even Wi-Fi 7 support for faster, more stable connections in crowded homes. Cleaner, lag-free streaming in apartments with multiple networks and devices. Improved airplay reliability, including zero buffering when mirroring content. Low-latency Bluetooth for controllers, headphones, and other peripherals. This means 4K Dolby Vision streaming, multiplayer games, and smart home automation all happen without hiccups. It's the kind of seamless performance Apple fans expect, but rarely get in crowded environments. Design and build. Externally, the new Apple TV 4K remains virtually unchanged, a compact, minimalist black box that hides easily behind your TV or entertainment center. The remote is expected to maintain its current design, including the USB-C Siri remote, with minor tweaks for ergonomics and responsiveness. While it doesn't look different, the real magic is under the hood. Apple is prioritizing internal horsepower and next-gen wireless capabilities over flashy redesigns, ensuring the device remains unobtrusive yet exceptionally capable. Price expectations and market position. Apple isn't likely to race Roku, Fire TV, or Google TV in terms of price. Instead, the strategy seems to be delivering premium performance at a justified price, likely around the same ballpark as the current Apple TV 4K, $129 to $149 range, with potential small adjustments if memory and storage are upgraded. Think of it this way. The new Apple TV isn't competing on cost. It's competing on overall experience, speed, 
ecosystem integration, and longevity. For anyone who streams frequently, plays games, or relies on Apple's ecosystem, it's a nobody knit. HomePod Mini Refresh, small but mighty. While the Apple TV 4K focuses on your living room, the HomePod Mini continues to be the silent backbone of Apple's home ecosystem. Launched originally in 2020, the Mini has been a favorite for users seeking compact audio, smart home control, and ecosystem integration. What's new inside? The refreshed HomePod Mini reportedly features a new S10 chip, offering snappier Siri responses, smoother handoffs from iPhone or iPad, and better multitasking within your home network. Commands that previously experienced lag, like setting reminders, controlling lights, or triggering automation scenes, should now execute almost instantaneously. Wireless and connectivity. The HomePod Mini will also include the N1 chip, aligning its wireless stack with the Apple TV 4K. This brings stronger Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connections, better stereo pairing reliability, faster matter slash HomeKit accessory response. Imagine pairing two HomePod Minis in a bedroom or office. With a new wireless performance, you'll get a more immersive, low-latency stereo experience without the previous dropout issues. Audio Impulvamonks Acoustically, the Mini's form factor hasn't changed drastically, but expect cleaner high-end frequencies, improved voice pickup at volume, fewer compression artifacts when streaming music or podcasts. It's a subtle but meaningful improvement for everyday listening, alarms, or voice interactions with Siri. Design and colors. Apple is reportedly introducing new finishes for the HomePod Mini. While not radical, these updates allow the device to blend aesthetically into modern home setups. Whether that's a minimalist white desk, a clean living room, or a tech-focused office. Who should upgrade? Apple TV 4K. Gamers looking for casual to mid-level console-quality experiences. Users upgrading from pre-2022 Apple TVs for faster app performance and airplay. Homes with multiple devices that require reliable, low-latency wireless. HomePod Mini. Anyone who values faster Siri responses. Users integrating multiple smart devices in a HomeKit or Matter ecosystem. Those using stereo pairs or small surround setups. For casual users who only stream Netflix or Apple TV+, Plus, upgrades are optional. But for anyone serious about smart homes, gaming, or performance streaming, these updates are substantial. Apple's Stealth Strategy This launch is part of Apple's evolving approach. No events, quick store updates, and press releases. It's efficient, subtle, and likely aimed at holiday shoppers and Black Friday buyers. Unlike the hype-heavy Mac or iPhone announcements, these home products get out quickly and efficiently. Apple's strategy here is clever. The Apple TV 4K becomes a mini living room console, and the HomePod Mini ensures your smart home responds instantly. Both products reinforce the Apple ecosystem without needing flashy presentations or long reveal videos. Final thoughts. The 2025 Apple TV 4K and HomePod Mini Refresh are about performance, reliability, and ecosystem cohesion. The Apple TV 4K SA7 Pro chip, expanded RAM, and in one wireless promise smoother games, faster apps, and a true all-in-one media hub. The HomePod Mini's S10 chip and new wireless stack make everyday smart home control faster, smoother, and more dependable. Apple isn't just refreshing hardware. They're enhancing your entire living space experience. Whether you're streaming, gaming, controlling your smart home, or setting up a stereo pair for music, these devices aim to make everything faster, cleaner, and more reliable. The quiet launch on November 12th is a reminder that Apple doesn't always need big events to make a big impact. Smart hardware, efficient software, and ecosystem integration are enough to redefine how we interact with home technology.